come Thanksgiving with Joe in Vermont. So I tried. It's freaking November. It's yeah. cold out and damp. Joe decides to take me to her favorite camp, which is outside. <laughs> now, I prefer cities and I prefer rest, but this camp that we go to, well, Joe is obsessed. Like, God, ho! We go way out somewhere with nothing but trees. She thinks it's perfection. I think I'm going to freeze. And I just know she's going to ask, Do you love it? And I never lie. She asks, Do you love it? Our friendship will die. She'll ask, If I love it, and I have to say, Joe, goodbye forever. <laughs> My answer is, No. <laughs> It's so effing cold out, I can't feel my toes. I can see trees whenever on PBS nature shows. I hate this place, but I can't tell her that. You don't understand. Joe's entire life is wrapped up in that land. And so I brace, because she's going to ask, do you love it? It's beyond my control. She'll ask, do you love it? I'll torpedo her soul when she asks. <laughs> But love it? Hell no. I see the love in her eyes, so I try to visualize just what the hell I'm seeing that she is seeing. She tells me she feels the energy crackling in the air. The way she describes it is exactly the way I feel when I walk through you. Joe. 